Take a break and join us. Gold Town, the Pahrump Nugget and Lakeside Casinos. We are out here with the Pahrump Hooligans, as they name themselves, presenting them with the trophy for the Pool for the Cure first annual for the Real Men Wear Pink. That all of the money that we were donated um, and raised for this event goes to the American Cancer Society. So we are presenting these fine gentlemen that pulled an ambulance the fastest out of all the departments uh, with their trophies, as well as the best dressed. So our department raised about $3,500 for this event, and the Real Men Wear Pink that oversee this event raised over $100,000. Wow. Are you guys going to be doing this again next year? Absolutely. We're going to encourage all departments to come out and compete for the trophy because this trophy is like Stanley Cup style. Uh -huh. There is a name on it, and they have to come back and defend it. I know that the second place came in within, like, seconds. Yeah. So I believe their fastest time was 16 or 17 seconds, mm -hmm. and the next team came in at about 19. We definitely showed up with our uh, being ready to go to, to compete. When we, uh, with that, we won best time. Uh, the other uh, part of the event was also the come as best dressed. So together as a team, we coordinate. We showed up as uh, 80, uh, 80s rocker outfits. So we had the old uh, the wigs, the uh, headbands, the uh, 80s rocker shirt, and uh -huh. the spandex. <laughs> and we definitely showed up and rocked the event. How many people uh, actually participated? We had a, a team of eight people. Wow. So you're going to do it next year? Oh, most definitely. We're, we're here to, we're ready to defend our title for next year.